talk the talk? Do you walk the walk? This place is pretty historic, relatively speaking. This hole here, if you can notice it. This is from troops training for World War II. Over here. And there's another one. You can almost see by the shape. It's T-shaped. Here's another one. Definitely defined shape still. After 80 some years. I don't know if you can hear that. That's the rucksack farting. I hope that stops after a while. Here's another big ass fighting position. That's big. And this is the end of that road that's on top of the ridge where the fighting positions are. And I do believe there's two guard in this road. Uh, yeah, there's one. A huge ass one there. And another one right there. So this is an old World War II airfield. Just still used by the government. I think FEMA owns it. And this is part of my new PT morning training area. It's full of Karens and granola fucks. The point being about the Karens and granola fucks is those people are dangerous. They'll make shit up to call the police. So you gotta be careful about them. I've heard some stories from some of the channel members about their dealings with Karens and how they will make up crap to call the police to feel important and to get you in trouble. Some local paganism. It's always good to see. Beautiful view of the mountains. Looks like the gods were good to me today. Found this on the ground. And it's a Leatherman. A real one. And the last hill. I like this area. It's relatively quiet. It's too far away from the homeless to make homeless camps in trouble. The trash. This is all around better grade people. So here is the medium. Full and ready to go. And the larger right next to it. I'm fully joyed about both of these rucksacks. Fully joyed. I wish I could recommend them, but I haven't used them long enough. I've had the medium for quite some time, but I just got the large. And today, the large on my back was amazing. I overfilled it with a crushing load and it was still way manageable. Really? And the suspensions are nearly identical. And for me, I credit the comfort to the channel in the center and the two raised channels on the side. And they both have it. So now I gotta take this large one, I gotta fill it up, and I gotta go do an overnighter with it. And more PT with it. And somebody said to me yesterday, I've done enough PT in my life, I have muscle memory, I'll be fine. And if you're of that opinion and you're resting in that camp, you're going to die when it matters. And they're both loaded identical. Food, cooking, Construction, food, cooking, construction, miscellaneous stuff in the top, both of them. 
werewolf suit tubular pouch is hooked to the bottom of this one it also helps us stand up straight it's one thing else i wanted to talk about with these things is one of my pet peeves is a rucksack needs to stand up on its own these do not they're actually propped up now you sit them on the ground they're going to tip over and you can also use some straps in the back to help you hoist it over the top of your head when you're getting ready to put it on it's kind of a pain in the ass not to have those other than that all the other options and all the other good shit makes up for that so i'm tolerating it I'm gonna push that aside and not really worry about it that much anyway more to come mm -hmm.